Hello guys, my name is Tomas Ortega. I'm part of the team WFMG for Spring 2019. And in this video, I'll be talking about the user story for fair price visualization with the code WFMG19. The product owners for this project are Steven Lewis and Dr. Miguel Alonso. First, let's read the description of the user story from Jira. It says, as a public user, I should be able to visualize the fair price in the past and in the future over a one year period, delineating past from future and using multiple data sources. The acceptance criteria is, it must work with a model created by the graduate students. The visualizations must be of appropriate size. It must work with a large data set and charts must be of high quality and ready to publish. The definition of done is passes all regression tests, passes all integration tests, and it should be able to be showcased in the spring review. If we go into the dashboard, we can see that the first graph that we get is for the average fair price. If we go a little bit down, we can see that the darker line represents the data from the Arima model and the lighter line represents the actual data for the average fair price. Um, the red line right here represents today's date. Now, it is today is not actually January 2017; it's February 2019. But um, I chose Jan I chose January because it showcases both sides of the of the data from the Arima model. Uh, we can see that the fair price, the the line for the fair price ends at the red line and the Arima continues and the Arima the data from the Arima model continues into the future. Um, we get <clears throat> here we get a slider so that the user can choose a range so he can choose the entire graph if, if he wants. He can choose to, to inspect the entire graph if he wants. Uh, he could also have done that with uh, clicking the all button. Um, you have different different buttons right here for one year. Here you can see that you get one year from the end, or or if you were here, if you place this um, this thing right here, you can you can get six months from there, one month from there, or again the entire graph. That's it. I hope that you liked the video. And please let me know any thoughts that you have um, and see you in the next video.